Ladies, if you wear wigs, weaves, braids, or extensions. And if you're tender headed like me. Or tangled just like me. Or have thick hair like mine. Or hate giving your hair cold. Keep watching! Guys, thanks for checking out another TM Hair Products video. His hair was washed, detangled, conditioned, blow dried like two days ago. So there's nothing on his hair right now. First of all, guys, let me just tell you guys follow us on Facebook. Facebook's um, Sunday nights at 7 30 central so after you see this video I post this video up at around 7 go over to Facebook we'll be live on Facebook so join us live on Facebook on Sunday nights at 7 30 now I am parting his hair off I'm going to do the old classic two strand twist you can never get old two strand twist will never go out of style so now his nape I'm going to do in smaller sections because I don't want it to be too chunky. I'll be using TM Hair Products Perfect Assist Stylinators, which you see in the upper left hand corner of your screen, is what I'll be using to twist his hair. Now, with the Stylinade, you can go light to medium. I wouldn't put a whole lot on his head, as you see on my finger. That's how much I'm going to put on his hair. And I focus mainly on the root, and then I run it down the length of his hair, and then I focus on the ends, because the ends are the oldest part of his hair. Now, I tell everybody, keep in mind, when you're doing two-strand twists, the smaller the twist, the tighter the coil when you're doing two strand twists. The bigger the twist, it's the looser the coil, so you have more of a wavy look. So keep that in mind. And also, I tell people when you two strand twist the hair, when you take it out, it's going to double in volume. So keep that in mind when you're picking the size of your two strand twist, that is going to double in volume. And you'll see in the pictures later on in the video. Now, because the nape is what gets messed up easy, I did those a little bit smaller than the rest of his twists. Now, because his hair is blow dried, it's going to give him length. He's not going to have as much shrinkage. So what I like to do is spray the end of the hair with water and then add a little bit of stylinade so he gets the best of both worlds. He gets length as well as coil. I like a very defined coil. If your twists are not looking like Raggedy Ann or Andy, and I'm telling my age now, but I like that old school telephone cord kind of coil. So that's what we're going through. So going for. So now I am parting his hair off on half moons. You can do bricks. You can do whatever you like. Triangles. You can do whatever you like. But I think half moons are are good for especially people who are starting out with twisting their hair because you can see the spacing. You can see where you want to cover the next twists. Like the twist I'm putting in now is between two twists. I hope that makes sense. So you can see the spacing essentially is what I'm saying. I focus on the root because his hair sweats a lot. And you see how I run it down his hair. combing the stylinate through so the stylinate is going to fight odor it's going to fight frizz it's going to define his hair when i take his twists out i don't have to put any oil or anything on my hands when i take his twists out because his hair is so moisturized and the stylinate fights frizz his hair doesn't get frizzy and i think i took the twists out maybe two days later if i'm not mistaken now the the stylinate that oozes through the twist as you see there i like to take that you see how i run my hand down it down that twist and get the rest of that stylinate and continue twisting so that i don't waste any of the stylinate now because we're closer to his ends i like to add a little more stylinate to the ends because those are the oldest part of his hair Coil his ends and you want a nice 
coil on the end of your twists. I lightly mix this here with water, very lightly. Now, as you can see, his edges are not as thick as his twists in the back because those, um, when you make the edges thick as you, as thick as you would in the back, I'm excuse me, you guys, I'm a little tired. It makes the hair frizzy, so you want to be able to try to catch up the edges when you twist, so you don't want the edges your your front perimeter to be as thick as the rest of your hair, and it also gives the hair a little texture to me when when you have them slightly a slight difference in size. And I hope that makes sense, but you'll see like once I twist them out. So that's all I did, you guys. I continue to separate the moons and twist his hair. And I love his twist. They look so juicy. That's what I like. I like thick two-strand twists. This is the finished look the next day. His hair is still moisturized. I brought you guys in close so you can see how moisturized his hair is now. This is his hair untwisted. When I said it doubles in volume, I brought you guys in close. His hair is very moisturized. It's very healthy. This is some side view. You can see all the definition that the styling aid gives his hair. This is a very close-up shot so you can see the definition, the shine, the luster. And that's all from using the Perfect Assist Styling Aid on his hair. That's it. I didn't use any other oils when I took them out. So if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below, guys. And I will talk to you in the next video. Bye, guys.